Francis Heritage introduces three special Alpha Male 4 Cs in this new GT collection. What's good guys, welcome back to Ron's Rise, welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to another video where to celebrate the unbreakable bond between Alpha Male and Nicola Larini, the 1993 DTM champion with Alpha Male's 155 V6 Ti, the Stellantis Heritage Department, Alpha Male, Fiat, Lancia, and Abarth, has designed and developed the 4C Project GT collection, Nicola Larini, which will present three unique and spectacular models based on a supercar that in 2014 brought back the Michione brand here to the United States of America. The 4C Project GT collection was unveiled today in a video made in turn at the classic workshops and the virtual room of the Alfa Romeo Style Center or Centro Stili where Nicola Larini met Alessandro Rivera, Special Vehicles Operation Manager of Stellantis Heritage, and Alessandro Macalini, current Alfa Male Design Project Manager and Designer of the 4C. Now the video where I will link in the description offers an exciting preview of these three collector's items and highlights their exclusive appearance. Now the decision to make this tribute to the 4C was not accidental because Nicola has always expressed immense admiration for this car, appreciating the quality that only a professional driver could understand, such as the lightness, speed, reactivity, and grip. Now, with a bold and aerodynamic design inspired by the Alfa Romeo icons of the past, the Alfa Romeo 4C is a sports car with two shell seats, rear wheel drive, and a centrally positioned engine. Still impressive today for a compact sports car capable of thrilling Alfa Romeo enthusiasts around the world. Now, Nicola says, in quotes, what emotions do I feel when I am presented with the Alfa Romeo 4C? Well, too many to name, but honestly, I would prefer to talk about sensations because I had the opportunity to get to know it, live it, and guide it fully on a real test bench like Boloco. There I had the opportunity to push it to the limit, and I realized that despite being a road vehicle, it is made for the track. By her abilities, you can't understand how safe she is until you push her to the limit. It's also comfortable enough to be a sedan, but it has unparalleled performance, especially in terms of safety. I've never driven a car so easy to handle at high speeds, which is the most important thing when dealing with powerful vehicles. I think that 4C will remain in the hearts of car enthusiasts and in particular of the new owners of the new collection that bears my name. I hope they live the best sporty driving experience possible. Now, produced by part of Solantis Heritage, Reloaded by Creators program, the three exclusive 4C Nicola Larini are the result of modifications made to pre-existing cars. More specifically, the three captivating liveries chosen by the Tuscan driver, Stellantis Heritage, and the Alfa Romeo Style Center play a key role in its appearance and pay tribute to the typical audacity of the Italian brand when it comes to choosing distinctive and memorable colors. In fact, the 4C GT Nicola Larini collection was inspired by the original liveries of the iconic Giulia GT of the 70s and is available in colors like pine green, plum red, and ochre yellow all embellished with white accents on the front and rear bumpers. Now, Alessandro Macalini explains in quotes, together with Nicola, we chose the pine green, the plum red, and the ochre yellow, three colors that are a part of the history of Alfa Romeo and that were present on the Julia GT and GTV of the 70s. On the 4C, the colors have been slightly revisited to make them more compatible with the bodywork. In addition, in a tribute to its competitive traditions, we worked on the graphics to produce a specific livery for each model. We listened to Nicola's suggestions to recreate a racing atmosphere, even the interiors. For example, we used a black microfiber to remove anything that could cause reflections inside the vehicle, while making sure to maintain the required grip for the seat and steering wheel. Now, with that said, these three bright and vibrant colors further emphasize the sculptural shape of the Alfa Romeo supercar. They are exalted by the inclusion of Nicola Larini's signature and the brand logo on the dashboard. Two names destined to be associated with each car over the years, as well as the alloy wheels that have been painted to match the vehicle's livery. Now the driver's autograph can also be found inside the interior on the dashboard, which has also a special upholstery with accents that recall the color of the body, highlighting the uniqueness of these fascinating and special models. Now made for the collectors, the brand enthusiasts around the world, the Alfa Romeo 4C Nicola Larini is already available to order and will be produced certified and sold directly by the Stellantis Heritage Department, which protects and preserves the historical heritage of the Italian brands Alfa Romeo, Fiat, Lancia, and Abarth. Now, if you want more information, 
you can visit heritageestelantis.com. And just for reference, the Alpha Romeo 4C supercar designed by the brand Style Center recalls iconic models such as the 33 Stradale with a minimalist design but extraordinary performance when equipped with a aluminum four-cylinder engine that delivers 240 horsepower and has an empty weight of only 895 kilograms, offering an exceptional weight-to-power ratio under 4 kilograms per horsepower. Now, with an acceleration from 0 to 100 kilometers in 4.5 seconds and a top speed of over 250 kilometers an hour, the 4C stands out for its agility and sportiness, registering a record time on the Nürburgring for cars with power up to 250. But with that said, which livery are you taking? Drop those comments down below. Now, if you guys did enjoy the video today, make sure you give it a big thumbs up, but subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell so you don't miss one video. And we will see you guys in the next one. Peace.